poked. How's that light on her face down there, you guys? I think we need a little more light. A little more? Yeah, on her face there. Can we have just, yeah, move it over th yeah, this way yeah, a little bit. This way, please. There um, we go. Essentially what we're honoring her for is because of why we wanted her to start this way. So it's essentially, you know, what you want people to know about her that they may not know from just having seen her as an actress. And <clears throat> if you've seen some of the movies that we shot, I mean, that we cut into her tribute reel, you can mention a specific thing that you were touched by in a specific movie. Some of the films that we cut into the reel include Drowning in Eyes, um, Alice Doesn't Return in the Morning. Right. Did, did you see that new one with Ashley Judd? No. Oh, it's so good. Is it? Yeah, it's really good. It's a really good old film. Um, what is it? It's a film about Ashley coming to terms with her dad, essentially, and coming to terms with her closed heart. And we, we, really, really, oh yeah, every daughter who has a father should, <laughs> who has a struggle, <laughs> should watch that. Um, and then we cut in some Mrs. Monk, we cut in some Wildest Hearts. Um, oh God, ask me, but don't ask me, you know. About her film. Ask no, her no. About her. No, I was gonna say, don't ask me too many general, you know, be be kind of, because otherwise, You'll talk. yeah, I could ramble. And, and I, you want to get out of here. Speak. Okay. So how long did you know Diane, and what do you want people to know about her? I know Diane Ladd about 30 years, maybe more. And I want Diane to know that she is a gift. A gift is a friend, a fantastic friend. Um, she is such an intelligent woman. She's an extraordinary actress, an extraordinary mother. And I love her dear. I love her. I love you. Beautiful. Do you want to talk about why she's deserving of the last name she had in her life? <sighs> or it might be too soon. <laughs> um Diane is deserving of a lifetime achievement award. A little, Diane is deserving of a lifetime achievement award because she has achieved so very much. She's made extraordinary movies. I've said that already. Extraordinary. Let's see. She's made her 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 um, her body of work is fantastic. She's such an intelligent woman, and she's a, a, a member of the, uh, on the board of SAG. She's, um, she's achieved an enormous amount in, in her lifetime, and so therefore she deserves a Lifetime Achievement Award. <laughs> Is, are there any special movies that are, are your favorite movies that you want to talk about, where there's one moment that, wow. Well, you know, I forgot to say Diane is also a great director. Uh, she directed uh, Mrs. Monk. Isn't that the name of it? Mrs. Monk. Mrs. Monk. And um, that's quite an achievement. And uh, she, I think I worked with Diane in a movie. I, um, I worked with Diane in a movie called The Cemetery Club, where Diane played a Jewish woman, and she was great. And I was the token Jew. So it was a great experience, very funny. And... Um, and uh, and what other what other movies do I love of hers? What's uh, Rambling. The Rambling? Oh yeah, Rambling Rose. She and Laura Dern, her daughter, uh, both were nominated for an Academy Award, quite deservingly. And um, she's just a, a great, fabulous actress. From the first time I ever saw Diane act in Alice Doesn't Live Here Anymore, because I think that was the first time I ever saw her. I was so moved by her performance. I'm moved by her, her ability to go so deep inside herself. And um, she's just a very, very fine actress and director, and I've said it all. I think that'll do it. Is there anything else that you... I'm trying to... Like, uh, what I asked her husband, and what I've asked a couple people is, is there anything you've never told Diane that... Uh, I mean, you're pretty communicative. You're a New York Jew. You say yeah. you say what you feel, but is there anything that, that I've ever said? Because this no, this whole thing about being uh, witness, the acknowledgement of your love, and being witnessed by all the people in the room, is 
kind of even taking a second at me. That's a profound way. It's an extraordinary experience. So what do you want people most to know about Diana? Diana is probably one of the most generous people I've ever known. Um, when she's your friend, there's nothing that Diane won't do for you or for one. And um, I want her to know, and uh, let's see now, she's also very courageous. Okay, you want to start again? So <sighs> Diane is your friend. Oh, you almost cried. What did I say? You said when Diane is your friend, she's one of the most generous people I ever knew. Yeah. Diane is one of the most generous people I've ever known. And when she's your friend, there is absolutely nothing that she will not do for you. So, I love you, Diane. Have a wonderful evening. And I'm so happy to be able to share this evening with you. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Are you going to play back?